of course I had to see what the hype was all about I had to another video so first and foremost if you are not yet subscribed then go ahead and click that subscribe button down below in the area that it's in it's either on this side or this side this side this side yeah it's down so i am coming to you guys with a review on the fenty beauty makeup or foundation rather I love the fact that Rihanna has came out with 40 shades for basically every skin tone. 40 shades. 40 freaking shades. She has shades for albinoism. Albinism. I'm not really sure if I'm saying it right. Forgive me if I'm not. But she has light, light shades. And she also has dark, dark, dark shades. And I commend you, Miss Riri Rihanna, for doing such a thing. The foundation retails for $34, which is good. It better be one ounce, Rihanna. Don't be trying to get us 1.08 fluid ounces, okay? So it's $34. That's a really good buy when you're buying high-end foundation because, like I said in my last review, you have other brands that are like $40, $38, $44, $45. So this gives you the same full coverage as those higher end foundations for a few bucks less in if you guys want to see my thoughts if you guys want to see my first impression a demo as well as my final thoughts then just keep watching so last night I went to Sephora and I got the Rihanna Fenty Beauty foundation Ooh, it's all wrapped up all cute. Y'all, I never go to Sephora because I work at Ulta. So, I can't get a discount at Sephora. And pretty much everything that I want at a Sephora, I can get from Ulta. So, yeah, I never go in Sephora. And I didn't know that they even wrap stuff this cute. That's cute. So, I got the Pro Filter Instant Retouch Primer. And I also got the soft matte long wear foundation and i got the color 440 so let's hope that this works for me and let's really just jump right into the video so in all the pictures the packaging looks really boring but when i went in the store and i saw this is like everything is so freaking cute like nothing is like cylinder or circular and nothing is square like they're all like this in between octagon type thing this one is an octagon this is one is sextagon because they, this one is kind of round whatever and then it has like this cute like matte thing going on it's so cute i love it got a little pump on here we're gonna try It actually smells pretty good. I don't know about, about y'all, but I always smell, smell pretty much everything. <laughs> okay. So off the back, I like how it does give you like this velvet type feel and it doesn't give you the white cast. A lot of primers, especially if they're like pore minimizing, which I think this one is too. Smooth pore diffusing finish, extended makeup wear. Oh yeah, that's it. It doesn't give you like this white cast that a lot of them do. I like that. I like that. 
So then we have the foundation. I think the packaging is cute. I think the shape of it's cute. I think the like matte looking finish is cute. Um, I like it. It's tiny. It's small. I like it. It's not boring to me. It looked boring on the pictures. So this foundation is medium to full coverage for all long wear and light as air. So let's see how that is. It says you're supposed to shake it. And I'm going to put it on the back of my hand. So it is kind of, it's not thick. It's kind of runny. Well, it's not like terrible runny, but okay, it's rolling off. But here we go. And I was told to go lighter because it did oxidize. It does oxidize. Look. Let me get the. This is a nice coverage. I'm trying to get this in before the storm come y'all. <laughs> Look at that. And y'all know you got to be careful with these ring lights. They will wash you out. It does feel light as air. Oh, and it has like, uh, it does oxidize. It's already oxidized a little bit on my hand. I'm going to do a little bit more. It looks so freaking smooth. It feels smooth. Oh, yeah. like this Rihanna Rihanna and the the color is perfect the color is perfect like it's perfect oh my gosh I'm gonna do another layer just because I want to see what it's gonna look like if we're trying to go more full coverage because it does, it looks like skin. Like, it looks, which is okay. Like, it looks like skin. Look at that. You know what, Rihanna? I commend you. This foundation is everything that it claims to be. It's lightweight. It's medium to full. It's smooth. Oh my gosh. I didn't want to fall in love with it. I'm not going to lie. I didn't want to fall in love with it just because I can't keep spending money on makeup alright so this is what it looks like And I'm going to finish my makeup and then I will come back and give my final thoughts. On to my thoughts. <sighs> I love it. 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 I love the fact that it's not heavy. Like, 
it feels like skin and it looks like skin like that's so important when you're wearing foundation it doesn't feel like it's going to clog my pores i don't feel like it's going to sweat off my face i feel like i'm wearing a light foundation yet i have full coverage if you guys can see the beats that i am bringing you guys okay personally after wearing this foundation it is definitely worth the hype first of all the hype is mainly i think should focus the fact that she came out with 40 freaking shades 40 freaking shades for everybody but secondly the makeup is also a really good makeup i'm loving the foundation the kilowatts highlighter If you are somebody who is obsessed with makeup and you're obsessed with having that freaking highlight, if you're obsessed with having that gold highlight, get the Kilowatts highlighter and Trophy Wife because it's so freaking highlighty. Like, it's yellow, so if you don't like a yellow like highlight, then I wouldn't recommend it. But it's sparkly. It's so gorgeous i definitely recommend the makeup you guys if you're looking for a new foundation to buy then this is not a bad one to go with like 34 dollars, like i said but if you just want to try it out don't try it out if you don't want to keep it because you're gonna fall in love with it i'm in love with it like okay i hope you guys enjoyed this video i really hope it was helpful i'm still kind of new to doing reviews i just know if i like something and if i don't and this I love so yeah if you guys enjoyed this then please give it a thumbs up don't forget to subscribe to my channel and yeah I'll see you guys in my next video